This is just a short video to show you a little bit about what the E-Leaf iJust 16 and the E-Leaf iJust 14 look like. This is your GS16. Here, let's get it over here. This is your GS16 um, glassomizer, and uh, it screws on to your battery. And your battery, you can see, it's both 510 and Ego threaded here. In my review, I talk about this bezel here not being able to know that it is, or not being able to tell that it's um, a variable voltage, which I guess is my mistake. But, um, you know, there's no markings there, so I just thought it was a, a pretty bezel for a minute. And then here is your um, LED timer, 93% battery life. If I press this down, it's going to give me a, a drag timer. And, uh, and that's pretty much it. I'll uh, provide a, a, a video of me vaping on this thing um, at another time. But I just cleaned this one out to change flavors. It, too, is a really good-looking battery. It's, a, it's the D14. And this one is 650 ma, I believe. And pretty much the same thing. It works the same way. It's just a little bit smaller. D14, um, the GS14. Uh, clear miser is, is exactly the same except for the size uh, it's thinner and less capacity and this of course is my everyday spinner and x-jet or this is an aspire uh, actually and um, size comparison this is a this is a 650 battery here so you know they're pretty similar and but this the uh, the iJust D16 and 14 both outperform the spinner and the X-Jet quite a bit. This is the uh, stainless steel version that I got. Um, this is a 510 connector only, so I can use any 510 tank um, that I wanted to use on here. And uh, it too works pretty much the same way. And and that's just, and that's about it. So, you know, there's it's no big deal. Uh, I don't know what the price of these yet um, are, but uh, I don't think they're going to be that much money. Uh, I like them a lot, and uh, and I plan on using it quite a bit. And that's about it. If you want one, hang on. I'll update the review and uh, let you know when they're out and where you can buy it.